number one thing that attracted me to trikes was the versatility. Floats, snow skis, big tires, welded airframes, nitrogen suspension, the fact that it's portable, you can pack a tent and your sleeping bags and a little bit of gear and go disappear into places that nobody has ever been. We fly into places that we absolutely could not get to from a car. Short takeoff and landing opens up the world of where you can go, which opens up another world of what you can do when you get there. It's very simple to set up and take down. It's not dependent on multi-million dollar airports or facilities. We take it to sandbars. We take it to go hunting. We take it to go fishing. Uh, we take it to get out there and go for a hike and just get away from everything. If you like motorcycles, if you like being on a jet ski, if you like being on an ATV, driving on a nice sunny day in a convertible, you will like the feeling of a trike. It's very similar to that. The type of flying that I do is terrain-based flying. You work with the terrain. Whatever the terrain does is what you do, and you're thinking a mile and a half to two miles ahead of yourself. But what's nice about flying an open-air anything is that you're one with the topography, the nature, the smells, the feelings, the temperature changes, and anybody that rides a motorcycle will identify with that. There is no substitute for the sensation of freedom when you leave the ground in an open cockpit trike at 40 miles an hour.